Hi, I'm Julie Jara from New Frequency Healing. Today I'm going to talk to you to answer a question that a lot of people have been asking me. Can frequency healing help to detoxify the jab? So I was interviewed recently by Michael from Cafe Lockdown. He asked that question and I feel that um, I needed to say a little bit more than what I had time for then. And um, because there's there's so much fear around this topic. As usual, the media has done a stellar job of reporting the fear on both sides of the questions. And there's nothing new about that. But if you look around, the world has not ended. It hasn't gone where um, yet, where we think we were told that it was going to go. Um, although there have been some really terrible effects that some people have been through. If you're one of the lucky ones who have experienced no injuries, no side effects, kept your job, still have all your family alive and around you in good health. If you can afford to pay your mortgage, well, that that's that's great, wonderful. But there are many people who've had losses, and I am so sorry to all of those people who have had these situations come up. Um, the answer to the question is, can frequency healing help to help with the jab? Um, when we raise our vibration, we're stepping away from the fear. We change our DNA, our cells become more efficient, and our natural immune system can work a lot more effectively. So this question would be answered in the same way if you ask, can frequency healing help my diabetes? Can it help my sore back? Can it help my hip problems, my chronic sinus? Um, can it help me to find a better job? Can it find me help me to find the love of my life or end my abusive relationship? In Western medicine, we treat the symptoms, and these are all symptoms of something going wrong. Um, but in frequency healing, what we do is we raise our vibration to another level so that you experience life from a higher level. So can it help to detoxify from the jab or with injuries? From what I've seen in the healings over many years um, with both people and animals, anything is possible. Anything can be healed, whatever situation you find yourself in. The thing is, when there's life, there is hope. And the types of healings that I've seen, well, look, it's all listed. There's a lot. There's hundreds of testimonials of people, of stories of healings on my website, which is juliejara.com. If you look up the blog of healing stories, there are so many different stories that is so varied, you know, you can say, can it help with X, whatever your situation is. Um, people have had healing from that. It does it because we're not targeting that area. We're looking at the person as a holistic being. So no matter what you think is going on, it can change. I hope this answers that question a little bit better. Um, that that perhaps you realize that by increasing your vibration, healing can happen. I've seen it happening to so many people also. Um, it's just sort of um, a matter of deciding. Like when you think about having a healing, that is the time to have a healing as soon as you've thought about it. Don't wait until it's too late. Don't wait until you really are sick. You know, um, preventative is so much a better way. That's what I do for myself. I take care of myself before it gets to that next level. So, um, and, you know, there are many ways you can do preventative health, but frequency healing is, is, I think, the best way in so many different areas that can help.
hope this gives a little bit of understanding on that question. Uh, I would also be very happy to talk to you if you want. Send me an email to julie at juliejara.com. Give me a call. Um, put a message here where, where you're finding this recorded and I'd be very happy to talk to you. Thank you. Bye-bye.